A main mathematics paper, 27th shift 1 paper. First problem, if f of x is equal, if f of x is equal, so matrix cos x minus sin x 0, sin x cos x 0, 0, 0, 1, this is given matrix f of x. If f of x equal to cos x minus sin x 0, sin x cos x 0, 0, 0, 1, then, then statement 1, S1 is statement 1 is f of minus x is inverse of inverse of f of x. Statement 2 is f of x plus y is equal to f of x into f of x. So, first option is both are true, second option is both are false, third one is only statement 1 is true, fourth one is only statement 2 is true. Now, first we have to verify. So, here we are given f of x. So, f of minus x is inverse of f of x. Okay. So, that is, so now f of minus x into f of x. So, we have to verify this to f of minus x into f of x. So, that is equal to f of cos of minus x is equal to cos x. Sin of minus x is equal to minus sin minus into minus plus sin x. Now, this is 0. So, minus sin x, next cos of minus x is equal to cos x, 0, 0, 0, 1 into. So, f of x, f of x is equal to given matrix that is equal to cos x minus sin x. So, 0, now sin x, cos x, 0, so 0, 0, 0. Now, so multiply these two, so we get now cos x into cos x, cos square x plus sin x into sin x, sin square x plus 0, that is 1. So, cos x into minus sin x minus cos x into sin x, next plus sin x into cos x, so plus 0 and again 0 plus 0, 0. So, we get here, first one is 1, 0, 0. Now, second row will be 0, 1, 0. Now, third row will be 0, now 0, 1. So, this is equal I, identity matrix. Okay. So, now f of x is into f of minus x into f of x equal to we get I. So, now, so here a b is equal to I, then so b is the inverse of a. So, that here f of x into f of minus x into f of x is equal we get i. So, therefore, here f of minus x is the inverse of f of x. Therefore, f of minus x is the is inverse of inverse of f of x. So, statement 1 is true. So, first statement is true. Now, we have to verify second statement. So, what is that? f of x plus y is equal to f of x into f of y. So, now <coughs> take this f of x into f of y. So, f of x into f of y. So, that is equal to cos x minus sin x 0 sin x cos x 0 0 0 1 into f of y is nothing but cos y minus sin y next 0 sin y into cos y 0 0 0 1. Now, multiply these two. So, we get cos x into cos y cos x into cos y minus sin x into sin y. So, that is cos of x minus, so
so cos x into cos y cos minus sin x into sin y that is cos of x plus y so cos of x plus y now here cos x into minus sin y minus sin x into cos y okay so that so cos x minus cos x into sin y so minus sin x into cos y so here cos x into minus sin y next minus sin x into cos y so next zero zero now cos x into zero zero minus sin x into zero zero plus zero so that is here sin x into cos y sin x into cos y plus cos x into sin y plus zero next second one minus sin x into sin y plus cos x into cos y okay next minus sin x into sin x into minus sin y cos x into cos y plus zero next zero zero next one so zero zero yes so that is one okay next here so sin x into zero zero cos x into zero so zero into one that is zero now here next one zero into cos y zero zero into sin y zero next zero so zero zero next zero 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 next zero plus zero plus one so this is equal to this is equal to cos of x plus y next sin a cos b minus cos a sin b so minus of here we get sin of x plus y so this is zero next here sin a cos b plus cos a sin b sin of x plus y so here cos of x plus y so we get zero so zero zero one this is nothing but f of x plus y so here f of x into f of y is equal we get f of x plus y so statement 2 is also true so our correct option is both are true that is option 1 okay, limits me this problem if a is equal to limit x tends to 0 square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 minus root 2 by x power 4 and b is equal and b is equal to limit x tends to 0 sin square x by root 2 minus square root of 1 plus cos x find a minus b cube find a b cube a into b cube a into b cube so first a is equal to limit x tends to 0 so square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 minus root 2 by x power 4 now you have to rationalize the numerator now we get that is equal a is equal to limit x tends to 0 so multiplying both numerator and denominator by square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 minus root 2 into square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus root 2 divided by x power 4 into square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus root 2. Now, this will be a square minus b square. So, that this is equal to limit x tends to 0. So, we get 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 minus 2 divided by. So, x power 4 into square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus root 2. Now, that is equal to that is equal to here. So, limit 
x tends to 0. So, square root of 1 plus x power 4 minus 1 divided by here x power 4 into square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus root 2. So, now again multiplying numerator and denominator by square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus 1. So, we get here limit x tends to 0 square root of 1 plus x power 4 minus 1 into square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus 1 divided by here we get x power 4 into square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus root 2 into square root of x power 4 plus 1. So, that is equal to here we get a is equal to limit x tends to 0. Now, 1 plus x power 4 minus 1 by x power 4 into square root of 1 plus square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus root 2 into 1 by here square root of 1 plus x power 4 plus 1. So, now minus 1 plus 1 get cancelled, x power 4, x power 4 get cancelled. So, the answer will be here. So, root 1 plus 1 that is equal to 1 plus 1 that is equal to here we get 2 root 2 here 2 that is equal to a is equal to here 2 root 2 here 2 root 2 into 2 that is equal to 4 root 2. 2 root 2 into 2 that is equal to 1 by 4 root 2 that is a value that is a. Now, similarly find the value of b. So, what is b here? So, b is equal to limit x tends to 0 sin square x by root 2 minus square root of 1 plus cos x. So, that is here b is equal to limit x tends to 0 sin square x by root 2 minus root of 1 plus cos. So, multiplying numerator and denominator by root 2 plus square root of 1 plus cos x. So, that is equal limit x tends to 0 sin square x into root 2 plus root of 1 plus cos x by. So, root 2 minus root of 1 plus cos x into root 2 plus root of 1 plus cos x. So, that is equal to here that is equal to. So, limit x tends to 0 sin square x root 2 into root of 1 plus cos x root of 1 plus cos x by here 2 minus of 1 plus cos x. 2 minus of 1 plus cos x. Now, here limit x tends to sin square x can be written as 1 minus cos square x 1 minus cos square x root 2 plus root of 1 plus cos x by 2 minus 1 1 minus cos x. Here 1 minus cos x into 1 plus cos x both are cancelled. So, that is so limit x tends to 0. Now, 1 plus cos x into root 2 plus root of 1 plus cos x. So, that is equal here b is equal. So, 1 plus cos 0 means 1 next root 2 plus again cos 0 is equal to 1 root 2. So, that 2 into 2 root 2 that is equal to 4 root 2. So, b is equal to how much 4 root 2. Now, we have to find the value of a b q. So, what is a 1 by 4 root 2. Now, here b cube is equal 4 root 2, 4 root 2, 4 root 2 that is equal 4 root 2 into 4 root 2 into 4 root 2. So, both are cancelled here. So, that is equal answer will be 32.
answer will be 32. So you can multiply these two values. So we get binomial theorem. If sum of coefficients in, if sum of coefficients, sum of coefficients in 1 minus 3x plus 10x square whole power n and 1 plus x square whole power n is a and b respectively. Then first option is a cube is equal to b, second option is equal to a is equal to b cube, third one is equal to a is equal to b, fourth one is equal to a is equal to b. So we need to find the sum of the coefficients of first one that is equal to a, sum of the coefficients of second one that is equal to b. So, to find the sum of the coefficient put x equal to 1, to find the sum of the coefficient put x equal to 1. So, therefore, a is equal to, so 1 minus 3 plus 10 whole power n that is 11 minus 3, 8, 8 power n. So, that is a. Now, b put x equal to 1, so that is equal to 1 plus x square. So, 1 plus 1 whole power n that is equal to 2 power n. So, we, you can write this as 8 power n can be written as, so how do you write this 8 power n? So, a is equal to 8 power n, b is equal to 2 power n. So, now find the, uh, now find b cube. So, b cube is equal to how much? 2 power n whole cube that is equal to 2 cube whole power n. So, that is equal to 8 power n. So, that what is the relation between a and b that is equal a is equal to b cube. So, that is equal option 2. So, complex numbers means the question if modulus of z minus i is equal modulus of z minus 1 is equal modulus of z plus i. So, z belongs to c then then the number of then then the numbers of z satisfying satisfying the equations are equations are. So, first option 0, second option 1, third option 2, fourth option 4. So, modulus of z minus i is equal to modulus of z minus 1 is equal to modulus of z plus i. Now, the argon plane, so this is equal to here origin. Now, z minus i, so that is equal to points are 0 comma i. Now, z minus 1, 1 comma 0, z plus i, so that is equal to 0 comma minus i. So, point 1 is here i, next second point is minus i, now here point is 1, 1 comma 0, okay, here 1 comma 0. So, i minus i 1. So, i 1 minus i. Now, equidistance from 0 to here, this is equal how much distance? 1 unit. Now, here 1 unit. So, this is equal 1 unit. So, modulus of z minus i is equal to modulus of z minus 1 equal to modulus of z plus i that is equal to only z equal to 0, z equal to 0 satisfy this equation only. So, that here z is the equidistance from first one 
second one and third one. So only z is equal to 0 is possible value. So therefore number of z is equal to 1. So only this is second option. This is the point z equal to 0 satisfied. Statistics let a1 comma a2 comma up to a 10 r or 10 observations, 10 observations, observations such that such that sigma i equal to 1 to 10 a i is equal to 50 and sigma i is not equal to j 10 a i into a j is equal to 1100. Then their standard deviation will be S D will be. SD will be first option root 5, second option root 30, third option root 15, fourth option root 10. Here, so A1 plus A2 plus up to A10 whole square is equal to how much we are given A1, A2, A3 up to A10 is equal to 50. So, that is equal to 50 square. So, this can be written as sigma a i whole square sigma a i whole square i equal to 1 to 10 whole square a i square. So, plus here 2 sigma a i into a j. So, i is not equal to j. So, that is called how much? 2000. 500, 2500. Here we are given a i into a j is equal 1100. So that sigma a i square is equal. So 2500 minus 2 into 1100. So that is equal 2500 minus 2200. So that is equal. 300. Now, first we need to find variance. So, what is variance? So, that is called sigma, square is equal sigma here a i square. So, sigma a i square by 10 minus sigma a i by 10 whole square. So, this is the formula. So, now here sigma a i square by 10 is equal to how much? 300 by 10. Now, here sigma a i is equal to 50, 50 by 10, this is mean whole square. So, that is equal 30 minus, so 25, this will be 5. So, this is variance. So, standard deviation is equal root variance, that is root 5. So, so, correct option will be 1, first option. Sequences series with the problem, find number of, number of common terms in the two given series given series. So, 4, 9, 14, 19 up to up to 25 terms up to 25 terms and 3, 9, 15, 21 up to 
37 terms. terms. Now, these are in AP, these are in AP with the common difference 5, here common difference 6. So, now 4 first series 9, 14, 19. So, up to here first term is 4, common difference is 5. So, now we need to find 25th term. So, how do you find 25th term? Tn is equal to A plus n minus 1 into D. So, T 25 is equal to A means first term 4 plus n means 25. So, 25 minus 1 into D means common difference 5. So, that is equal to 4 plus 24 into 5. How much? 124. Okay. So, here therefore, here series is 4, 9, 40, 14, sorry 14, next 19. So, 25th term is 124. Now, here what is the common difference? 5, D1 is equal to 5. Similarly, second series, what is the series? 3, 9, 15, 21. So, up to 37. So, again T n is equal to A plus n minus 1 into D. So, T 37 is equal to 3 plus 37 minus 1. D is common difference 6. So, 3 plus here 36 into 6. So, how much? 36, 216. 3 plus that is equal 2 1 9 ok. Now, second series is 3 9 15 21. So, last one is how much 2 1 9. Now, difference is D 2 is equal here 6. Now, first common term is what is first common term 9 here first common term is 9. So, common term 9. So, now find LCM D1, D2. So, find LCM of D1, D2. LCM of D1, D2 is equal to 30. Now, adding 30 to this value. So, we get 39. Again, so adding 30 to this value. So, we get 69. Okay. Next one is how much? 99. So, can we add next uh, 30 to this value? No. So, because see highest value is here 120 first. So, do not add 30. So, now 1, 2, 3, 4. There are 4 common terms. So, answer will be here. What is option here? So, options are ok. So, first option is 4 second option is 7, third option is 5, fourth option is 3. Therefore, here first option is A bar is equal to I bar plus 2J bar plus K bar, B bar is equal to 3 into I bar minus J bar plus K bar, A bar cross C bar is equal to B bar, and a bar dot c bar is equal to 3. So, find find a bar dot c bar cross b bar minus b bar minus c bar. So, first option is 24, second option is minus 24, third option is 18, fourth option is 15. Fourth option is 15. Here A bar dot C bar cross B bar minus B bar minus C bar. So, that is equal to here box of A bar C bar B bar is equal to box of A bar C bar B bar is equal to we can write A bar cross C bar dot B bar. 
so that is called a bar cross c bar is equal to we are given b bar b bar dot b bar is equal to modulus of b bar whole square so we are given modulus of b bar is equal to how much so 9 into 9 into 1 plus 1 plus 1 so that is equal to 27 27 right now here a bar dot c bar cross b bar minus b bar minus c bar is equal so a bar box of a bar b bar c bar a bar c bar b bar box of a bar box of a bar c bar b bar minus a bar dot b bar minus a bar dot c bar so that is equal to 27 a bar dot b bar is equal to here a bar dot b bar is equal to so 3 into here 3 into 1 minus 2 plus 1 so now a bar dot c bar is equal to so what is c bar a bar dot c bar is equal to 3 so 27 minus 0 minus 3 that is equal to 24 so that is option 1 okay next problem if the angle between if the angle between two vectors if the angle between two vectors a bar is equal to alpha i bar minus 4 j bar k bar and b bar equal to plus 4 k cap is acute is acute then then find least positive integral positive integral value of alpha positive integral value of alpha first option is 4 second option 5 third option 6 fourth option 7 so if the angle between two vectors a bar and b bar is acute then find least positive integral value of alpha for acute value a bar dot b bar greater than 0 so a bar dot b bar greater than 0 for acute value so a bar dot b bar is equal to alpha square next minus 4 alpha minus 4 greater than 0 so now adding 8 to this value we get alpha square minus 4 alpha minus 4 plus 8 minus 8 greater than 0 so alpha square minus 4 alpha plus 4 so that is equal to 8 greater than 8 so now alpha minus 2 whole square is greater than 2 root 2 whole square so alpha minus 2 whole square minus 2 root 2 whole square greater than 0 that is equal to alpha minus 2 plus 2 root 2 into alpha minus 2 minus 2 root 2 greater than 0 so that is equal to that is equal to alpha minus 2 minus 2 root 2 into alpha minus 2 plus 2 root 2 greater than 0 so that is equal alpha is less than 2 minus 2 root 2 or alpha is greater than 2 plus 2 root 2 so that least value of alpha this is the least positive value so 2 plus 2 into root 2 is equal suppose 2 1.414 that is equal 2 into 1.41 is 
so it is near value is how much 2 plus 2 root 2 so near integer value how much so positive integer acute then least positive value of alpha so that is equal 2 into 1.414 how much 414 so so nearly value least value is least positive least positive integral value of alpha so least positive value that is equal near integer is 5 four points four points 0 comma 0 1 comma 0 0 comma 1 2k comma 3k are concyclic then k is then k is first option 4 by 13 second option 5 by 13 third one 7 by 13 fourth one 9 by 13 so these are four points are concyclic so now rough diagram so first circle is passing here four points that is equal 0 comma 0 now this is first point now four points are concyclic so that is equal now next point is 1 comma 0 next 0 comma 1 1 comma 0 next 0 comma 1 2 comma k so this is rough diagram this is rough diagram so now here 2 k comma 3 k these four points are concyclic concyclic points okay now this is origin 0 comma 0 now these are it is the diameter okay now e questions is x minus x1 into x minus x2 plus y minus y1 into y minus y2 is equal to 0 x minus x1 so that is called x minus x1 is equal to x into here x minus x1 so y minus y1 into here y into y minus 1 is equal to 0 so that x square minus x plus y square minus y equal to 0 now the point 2k comma 3k lies on this circle so that it should satisfy this equation 4k square minus here 2k plus 9k square minus 3k is equal to 0 that is equal to 13k square minus here 5k square 5k is equal to 0 now taking common k we get 3k minus 5 is equal to 0 k equal to 0 13k minus 5 equal to 0 if we take k equal to 0 now this will be 0 comma 0 so that is not possible so that k is equal to only here 5 by 13 this is answer 5 by 13 second option f of x is equal to 2 power sin of x minus 3 by x minus step x when x is positive x is greater than 3 so minus a by b into x square minus 7x plus 12 by modulus of x square minus 7x plus 12 x is less than 3 so b when x equal to 3 so here find find here number of number of ordered pair ordered number of ordered pair a comma b a comma b so that f of x is 
continues continues at x equal to 3 so continues means left hand limit is equal to right hand limit is equal to f of 3 left hand limit is equal right hand limit is equal to f of 3 so here f of 3 is equal to b f of 3 is equal to b now here limit extends to x is greater limit extends to left to side right hand limit is equal limit extends to 3 plus f of x is equal limit extends to 3 plus here 2 power sin of x minus 3 by x minus step x so x minus step x means here 3 plus means 3 point something step 3 point something is equal to 3 so we can write this limit extends to 3 plus sin of x minus 3 by x minus 3 so that is equal here 2 power limit extends to 3 sin of x minus 3 by x minus 3 so that is equal to 2 power 1 so 2 this is right hand limit now left hand limit is equal left hand limit is equal limit extends to 3 minus f of x is equal so limit extends to 3 minus minus a by b into here x square minus 7x plus 12 that is equal to x minus 3 into here x minus 4 so divided by here modulus of x square minus 7x plus 3 minus means here modulus of x minus 3 into x minus 4 so that is equal to x minus 3 into x minus 4 so answer will be minus a by b here so left hand limit is equal to right hand limit is equal to f of 3 so left hand limit is equal here 2 so 2 is equal here minus a by b is equal here f of 3 is equal b so 2 is equal b so here 2 is equal minus a by b so 2 is equal minus a by 2 that is equal a is equal minus 4 now b is equal to so a comma b is equal to here minus 4 comma so now number of ordered pair will be only one so number of ordered pair is equal to one so now if cos 2x minus a sin x is equal to 2a minus 7 has a solution as a solution for a belongs to closed interval p comma q and r is equal to tan 9 degrees tan 63 degrees tan 81 degrees tan 27 degrees then then p into q into r is equal to first option 40 root 5 32 root 5 30 root 5 48 root 5 so first cos 2x is equal to cos 2x minus a sin x is equal to 2a minus f so cos 2x is equal to 1 minus 2 sin square x minus a sin x is equal to 2a minus 7. Now it becomes 2 sin square x plus a sin x plus 2a minus 8 is equal to 0. Now this is a quadratic equation in sin x. So here sin x is equal to minus b plus or minus 
root of b square minus 4 ac 4 into 2 into 2a minus 8 by 2 into 2 s yes? so that is equal here sin x is equal minus a plus or minus root of here a square 16a minus 16a plus 64 by 4 that is equal minus a plus or minus root of a minus 8 whole square by 4. So, that is equal minus a plus or minus a minus 8 by 4. So, now here sin x is equal sin x is equal minus a plus a minus 8 by 4 or sin x is equal minus a minus a plus 8 by 4. So, that is equal sin x equal to 2. So, this is not possible. Next sin x is equal 8 minus 2 a by 4 that is equal 4 minus a by 2. So, here 4 minus a by 2. So, maximum value is sin x 1, minimum value is minus 1. Minus 1 is less than or equal to sin x is less than or equal to 1. So, that minus 1 is less than or equal to 4 minus a by 2 is less than or equal to 1. So, minus 2 is less than or equal to 4 minus a is less than or equal to 2. So, that is equal here. So, value of 8 minus that is equal 4 a minus 2 a by 2 right sin minus 1 is less than or equal to sin x is less than or equal to 1. So, now adding 4 to this value we get 2 is less than or equal to here. So, now minus 6 is less than or equal to minus a is less than or equal to minus 2. So, that is equal to 6 is greater than or equal to a is greater than or equal to 2. So, least value is 2, minimum value is 2, maximum value is 6. So, that is equal to here. So, that a belongs to 2 comma 6. So, therefore, p equal to 2, q equal to 6 here. Now, we need to find r value tan 9 degrees. Now, here tan 18 degrees can be written as cot 9 degrees. Next, tan 27 degrees. Now, tan 63 can be written as cot 27 degrees. So, that is equal tan theta plus cot theta is equal cot theta is equal sin by cos plus cos by sin. So, sin square plus cos square 1 by 2, 1 by sin theta into cos theta that is equal 2 cosecant 2 theta. Multiplying numerator and denominator by 2 that is equal 2 cosecant 2 theta. So, that that is equal 2 cosecant 2 into 9 that is equal 18, 2 cosecant 2 into 27 that is equal 54. So, 2 by sin 18 plus 2 by sin 54 degrees. So, sin 18 is equal root 5 minus 1 by 4. So, 2 into root 5 plus 1 by 4. That is equal 8 by root 5 minus 1. So, 8 by root 5 plus 1. So, that is equal r is equal. So, 8 into root 5 plus 1 plus root 5 minus 1 by so, 5 minus 1 that is equal 4. So, here these two cancel 2 root 4 root 5 that is equal 4 root 5. Now, P into Q into R is equal P is equal to Q is equal 6 R is equal 4 root 5. So, 48 into root 5 this is R. J main question paper 27th second shift to mathematics paper discuss just now. So, first problem an arna contains 6 ball black balls and 9 red balls. 4 balls are drawn from the arm twice without replacement. The probability that first 4 balls are 
black and second four balls are red in color is so here now and contains six black balls nine red balls nine red balls four balls are drawn from the urn twice without replacement the probability that the first four balls are black so required probability is so first four balls are black that is equal 6 by 15 so first ball now second ball is again black that is 5 by 14 that is third ball again black 4 by 13 next 3 by 12 now this is first four balls and second four balls are red in color how many red balls here nine red balls so that 9 by 9 by 11 into 8 by 10 into 7 by 9 into 6 by 8 so after simplification we get 3 by 715 so this is option number 3 okay right now the vertices of a triangle the vertices of a triangle are the vertices of a triangle are are a 1 2 2 b 2 1 2 c 2 2 1 the perpendicular distance of its ortho center from the given sides l1 l2 and l3 find the value of l1 square plus l2 square plus l3 square so now this is rough diagram now here a is equal to 1 2 2 now b is equal to 2 1 2 now c is equal to 2 2 1 here the distance from a to b is equal to b to c is equal a to c this is an equilateral triangle so that centroid is equal to ortho center so here a b is equal to b c is equal to c a therefore ortho center is equal to centroid ortho center is equal to centroid so what is centroid so x1 plus x2 plus x3 by 3 1 plus 2 plus 2 that is equal 5 by 3 next again 5 by 3 5 by 3 2 plus 2 plus 1 5 by 3 this is centroid is same as ortho center now ab midpoint of ab is equal to midpoint of ab is equal to what is midpoint here 2 plus 1 3 by 2 next 3 by 2 here 2 plus 2 by 2 that is equal to now we have to find here this is centroid is same as ortho center this is midpoint now what is midpoint here centroid is equal to 5 by 3 5 by 3 5 by 3 
so midpoint of ab is equal to 3 by 2 3 by 2 2 now here l1 is equal to distance from midpoint of ab to g that is equal to l1 is equal to square root of 5 by 3 minus 3 by 2 whole square that is equal to 5 by 3 minus 3 that is equal to 9 minus 5 that is equal to so 1 by that is equal to 1 by 36 plus 1 by 36 plus 1 by 9. So, this is equal to 1 by so here square root of 1 by 36 36 36 1 plus 1 plus here 4 that is equal to 1 by root 6. So, here it is an equilateral triangle therefore, L 1 is equal to L 2 equal to L 3 is equal to 1 by root 6. So, what we have to find here L 1 square plus L 2 square plus L 3 square. So, that L 1 square L 2 square L 3 square is equal to 1 by 6 plus 1 by 6 plus 1 by 6 that is equal to 3 by 6 is equal to 1 by 2 is upper option that is equal here second option. Now, let two sets two sets A and B having having M and N elements respectively respectively such that difference of the number of number of subsets of A and that of B is 56, then M comma N is here. So, now we are given let two sets A and B having M and N elements respectively such that difference of the number of subsets. So, number of subsets in A is equal to 2 power M. So, and number of subsets in B that is equal to 2 power N. So, we are given 2 power N minus 2 power N is equal to 56. So, here we can Verify the option, first option is 8 comma 3, second option is 8 comma 5, third one is 6 comma 3, fourth one is 7 comma 4, 7 comma 4. Here m is greater than n, here m is greater than here n. So, by taking options verification, we get m is equal to here m is equal to 6 and n is equal to 3. So, op option is 3. A is a square matrix of order 2 such that such that the roots of such that roots of the equation roots of the equation debt a minus lambda i is equal to 0 lambda i is equal to 0 or 1 and minus 3, then sum of 
sum of diagonal diagonal elements of matrix a square is first option 2 second option minus 3 third option 9 fourth option 10 now observe the problem if a is square matrix of order 2 such that roots of the equation det a minus lambda is equal to 0 or 1 and minus 3 then sum of diagonals elements of matrix sum of diagonal elements of matrix a square is so now here a is 2 by 2 matrix so let a is equal let a is equal a b c d a b c d now determinant of a minus lambda i is equal to 0 so that is equal a minus lambda so that is equal a minus lambda i is equal here first a minus lambda i is equal so a is equal a b c d next lambda 0 0 lambda so that is equal a minus lambda b C D minus lambda. So now take determinant of A minus lambda is equal to 0. A minus lambda i is equal to 0. That is A minus lambda B C D minus lambda equal to 0. So now A minus lambda into D minus lambda minus b c is equal to 0. So, that is equal lambda minus a into lambda minus d minus b c is equal to 0. So, lambda square minus lambda into a plus d plus a d minus b c is equal to 0. So, now sum of the roots here sum of the roots sum of the roots is equal to a plus d and product of the roots product of the roots is equal to a d minus b c a d minus b c here sum of the roots is equal to minus 2 next product of the roots is equal to here minus 3 product of the roots is equal to here minus 3 right sum of the roots equal to minus 2 product of the roots is equal to so now a square is equal to a square is equal to a b c d a b c d now this is a square so we get a square plus b c next b into a plus d next c into a plus d next d square plus b c this is a square now trace of a square is equal trace of a square is equal a square plus b c here a square plus b c plus d square plus b c d square plus b c so that is equal a square here a square plus d square plus 2bc 2bc now a square plus b square can be written as a plus d whole square minus 2ad plus 2bc so that is equal a plus d whole square minus here 2 into a d minus b c a d minus b c so 2 into here a plus d whole square a plus d whole square equal to 4 minus 2 into 
ad minus bc equal to minus 3 so that is equal here answer will be 4 plus 6 that is equal 10 that is equal 10 so so trace of a square is equal right so now 4 plus 6 is equal 10 that is fourth option let tan inverse x sorry let tan inverse x plus tan inverse 2x is equal to pi by 4 x is positive then number of positive values then number of positive values of x is or first option is 0 second option 1 third option 2 fourth option 3 now tan inverse x plus tan inverse x equal to pi by 4 when x is greater than 0 the number of positive value of x now tan inverse x plus tan inverse 2x tan inverse x plus tan inverse tan inverse a plus tan inverse or tan inverse x plus tan inverse y is equal to tan inverse x plus y by 1 minus xy so we can write this as tan inverse of x plus 2x by 1 minus x into 2x is equal to pi by 4. Now 3x by 1 minus 2x equal to tan pi by 4 which is equal to 1. So now by taking cross multiplication 1 minus 2x square is equal to 3x, 2x square plus 3x minus 1 equal to 0. So here x equal to 2x square, 2x square plus 3x minus 1 equal to 0. So, x equal to using minus b plus r minus root of minus b plus r minus root of b square that is equal to 9 minus 4 into a into c by 2 into 2 minus 3 plus r minus 8 by 4 that is equal to minus 3 here minus 3 plus or minus root 17 by 4. So, we can take x equal to minus 3 plus root 17 by 4 x equal to minus 3 minus root 17 by 4. This is negative value. So, here x equal to root 17 minus 3 by 4 this is positive. So, number of solutions is number of positive value of x is only 1. So, option 2 is correct. x square minus x minus 1 equal to 0. Let x square minus x minus 1 equal to 0 has roots alpha and beta. roots alpha and beta such that such that Sn is equal to 2023 alpha power n 2024 beta power n then then so, first option is S12 is equal to S11 minus S10. Second option is S12 is equal to S10 minus S11. Now, third one is S12 is equal to S10 plus S11. Fourth one is 
S12 is equal to minus S10 minus S11. So, this is the given problem. Now, here the relation between S12, S11, S10. Suppose if Ax square plus Bx plus C equal to 0, then condition is A into Sn, B into S minus 1 plus C into S minus 2 equal to 0. This is the condition. Now, here comparing with this equation, here A is equal to A is equal to 1, B is equal to minus 1, C is equal to minus 1. So, that put n is equal to 12 here. So, we get put n is equal to 12 because we have to find the relation between S12, S11, S10. So, first of all put n is equal to 12. Now, in this equation we get A equal to 1. So, 1 into S12, B is equal to minus 1, 1 into S11, C equal to minus 1, minus 1 into S10 is equal to 0. So, that here after simplification we get S12 is equal to S11 plus S10. Yes. Now, if A x square plus B x plus C equal to 0, then A into S n plus B into S n minus 1 plus C and S n minus 2 equal to 0. Now, comparing with this equation, we get A is equal to 1, B is equal to minus 1, C equal to minus 1. So, put n is equal to 12. So, we get 1 into S 12 minus 1 into S 11 minus 1 into S 10 equal to 0. So, after simplification, we get S 12 is equal to S 11 plus S 1. So, that is here third option is correct. So, integral here integral x power 8 minus x square by x power 12 3 x power 6 plus 1 into tan inverse x cube plus 1 by x cube into dx is equal to dx is equal to. So, we need to find the integral value of this. So, now tan inverse x cube plus 1 by x cube is equal to t. So, now differentiating both sides. So, we get 1 by 1 plus x cube plus 1 by x cube whole square into derivative of x cube plus that is called 3 x square minus 3 here minus 3 by x power 4 into dt into dx is equal to dt. So, now here that is equal 1 by 1 plus x power 6 1 by x power 6 plus 2 a square plus b square plus 2 a b into here by taking 3 common x square minus 1 by x power 4 dx equal to dt. So, now here x power 6 by x power 6 plus x power 6 into that is equal to x power 12 plus 2 x power 6 plus x power 6 3 x power 6 plus here x power 6 plus 2 x power 6 plus 1 into here x square dx is equal to 1 by 3 dt. So, now here x power 6 into x square that is equal to x power 8 that is equal 
x power 8 now minus x square divided by here x power 12 plus 3 x power 6 plus 1 into dx into dx is equal to 1 by 3 dt. So, now here x power 6 minus x square by x power 12 3 x power 6 plus 1 into tan inverse of this dx equal to here we can write this as integral x power 8 minus x square by x power 12 3 x power 6 plus 1 into tan inverse of x cube plus 1 by x cube into dx is equal this can be written as now total this is equal 1 by 3 dt. So, 1 by 3 into dt by this is t that is equal 1 by 3 integral 1 by t dt is equal log mod t plus that is equal 1 by 3 log modulus of tan inverse of x cube plus 1 by x cube plus c this is correct option. Next problem for the series twenty nineteen and of nineteen one by four eighteen into one by two up to one by four the twenty twentieth term term from end is n is. So, we need to find t 20 from the end. Third option is 117, fourth option is minus 120. Now, here this is I think this is in A p. So, we need to find common difference. So, what is common difference here? 20 minus here 19 that is equal to 19 into 4. So, 127 minus 127 here minus 120. So, 127 minus 120 here 1 minute. So, first we need to find common difference. So, common difference is equal to t2 minus t1 that is equal to here d is equal to here t2 minus t1 that is equal to 3 by 4. So, a is equal to now minus 129 1 by 4. So, t20 what is t20? Tn is equal to formula a plus n minus 1 into d. So, we need to find here t 20 is equal to so a that is minus 129 1 by 4 plus n minus 1 that is equal to 20 minus 1 into d is equal to 3 by 4. So, after simplification we get minus 115 that is equal to first option. Now, values of alpha values of alpha for which for which determined 1 3 by 2 alpha plus 3 by 2 1 1 by 3 alpha plus 1 by 3 2 alpha plus 3, 3 alpha plus 1, 0 is equal to 
0 lies in the interval in the interval lies in the interval. So, first option is 0 3 second option is minus 3 comma 0 third one is minus 2 comma 1 fourth one is minus 2 comma 0. So, values of alpha for which determine 1 3 by 2 alpha plus 3 by 2 1 1 by 3 alpha plus 1 by 3 2 alpha plus 3 3 alpha plus 1 equal to 0 is equal to 0 lies in the interval right here. So, now here operation is now C 3 is equal to now you can take C 3 is equal to C 3 equal to C 3 minus alpha into C 1 plus C 2. So, that is equal that is equal now here 1 3 by 2 alpha plus 3 by 2 1 1 by 3 alpha plus 1 by 3 2 alpha plus 3 3 alpha plus 1 0 is equal to 0 that implies here operation is C 3 minus alpha into C 1 plus C 2. So, alpha into C 1 means here 1 into alpha plus C 2 means 3 by 2. So, alpha plus 3 by 2 C 3 minus alpha into C 1 plus that is equal 1 1 2 alpha plus 3 3 by 2 1 by 3 3 alpha plus 1 now here 0 this is 0 now this is equal to 2 alpha square 2 alpha square plus 3 alpha plus 3 alpha that is called 6 alpha plus 1 plus 1. So, that is equal here 2 alpha minus of 2 alpha square plus 6 alpha plus 1. So, C 3 equal to so that is equal minus of is equal to 0. Now, find the determinant. So, that is equal here take this one take this column plus minus plus plus minus plus that is equal to minus 2 alpha square 6 alpha plus 1 into now here 1 by 3 into 1 minus 3 by 2 equal to 0. So, this is constant so that 2 alpha square now 2 alpha square 2 alpha square plus 6 alpha plus 1 is equal to 0. So, now this is equal it is a constant 0 by 0. So, that is equal this, this is 0 2 alpha square plus 6 alpha plus 1. So, alpha equal to minus 6 plus or minus root of b square minus 4 a c 4 a c by 4 that is equal minus 6 plus r minus 36 minus 8 by 4 minus 6 plus r minus here. So, 36 minus 8. So, we get how much 36 28 by 4. So, minus 6 plus r minus 4 7 are 2 root 7 by 4. So, minus 3 plus r minus root 7 by 4 root 7 by 2 root 7 by 2. So, now you can verify option verify an option. So, here alpha equal to minus 3 plus root 7 by 2. So, minus 3 minus root 7 by 2. So, now observe options here. So, we get second option. Now, the value lies in this option option 2 is correct
delta triangle ABC have vertices have vertices A 2 2 3 2 comma 2 comma 3 B 2 comma minus 3 comma 3 C minus 1 minus 2 3 and and length of internal angular angle bisector of angle A is L is L then then the value then the value of 2 L square is the value of 2 L square is now here triangle ABC of what is S now here rough diagram so now A equal to 2 comma 2 comma 3 2 minus 3 3 minus 1 minus 2 3 so these are a b c and length of internal angle or bisector here now a b is equal distance now a b is equal distance square root of here 0 next here 25 here 2 minus 2 that is equal 2 minus of minus 3 that is equal 5 square 25 here 3 minus 3 that is equal to 0 is equal to 5 5 units next a c is equal to here square root of 2 plus minus of 1 that is equal to 3 square 9 next 0 here 4 2 minus of minus 2 that is equal to 4 16 0 that is equal to 5 so 5 here a b is equal to a c so a b is equal to a c a b is equal to a c therefore d is the midpoint of b c therefore d is the midpoint of b c b c b c so d is equal to 2 minus 1 by 2 so that is equal to 1 by 2 minus 3 minus 2 by 2 that is equal to minus 5 by 2 3 plus 3 6 by 2 that is equal to 3 so 1 by 2 here we get 1 by 2 minus 5 by 2 d is equal to 1 by 2 minus 5 by 2 that is equal to 3 so AD, length of internal angular bisector of angle A is L, internal angle bisector, uh, then the value of 2 L square. So, here AB is equal to AC, therefore D is the midpoint of BC. Now, coordinates of D is equal to 1 by 2, minus 5 by 2, 3. So, now AD, so that is equal to AD is equal, AD is equal here, the point D divides the line segment joining B and C. In the ratio AB is to AC, 5 is to 5, therefore 1 is to 1. So, therefore D is the midpoint of BC. So, now here AD is equal, AD is equal here square root of, AD is equal square root of 2 minus 1 by 2 or 1 by 2 minus 2 whole square. Next, minus 5 by 2 minus 2 whole square 3 minus 3 whole square that is equal square root of 9 by 4 
plus 81 by 4 that is equal 90 by 4 this is equal to L this is equal to L so that now here 2 L square is equal now 2 L square is equal here 45 2 L square is equal 45 here L is equal square root of 90 by 4 L square is equal 90 by 4 2 L square is equal 90 by 4 into 2. So, that is equal 45. Okay. Let S1 is equal let S1 is equal 4 factorial factorial by 4 factorial whole power 3 factorial and S2 is equal by 5 factorial whole power 4 factorial. Now here 4 factorial is equal now 24. So, 4 factorial equal to 24 by 4 factorial whole power 3 factorial means 6 here S2 is equal 5 factorial that is equal 120 by 5 factorial whole power 24 5 factorial whole power 24. Now here so first one is S1 is now make 6 groups of 4 each that is equal make 6 groups of 4 each that is here 24 by 4 factorial whole power 6. So, that is 24 articles ni mano 6 members ki each one 4 4 distribute jayad ho idhi. Ikada 120 articles ni mano ko 24 members ki each persons ki 5 5 articles ni distribute jayad ho. And they are natural numbers. So, S1 is a natural number, S2 is a natural number. Therefore, here S1 belongs to N and S2 belongs to capital N. So, second option is right here. So, here 4 factorial by 4 factorial whole power 3 factorial means, 3 factorial means 6. Here 4 factorial is 24. 24 articles ni 6 members ki okokal ki 4 articles ni distribute jayad. Ikkada 120 articles ni 24 members ki Okuka member ki 5 articles ni distribute jayas in number of ways. So, they are natural numbers. Number of ways is equal to natural number. So, S1 belongs to N, S2 belongs to N. So, here second option is right. Next, three lines three lines two x minus y minus three is equal to zero six x plus three y plus 4 is equal to 0, alpha x plus 2 y plus 4 equal to 0 here does not does not form triangle does not form triangle then find step then find step sigma alpha square sigma 
alpha square where here alpha square here three lines does not form a triangle does not triangle does not form a triangle means these two lines are parallel first case is two lines are parallel second case is if lines are uh, lines are concurrent now first case is if 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 two lines are two lines are parallel parallel then now 2 by alpha is equal minus 1 by 2 2 by alpha is equal minus 1 by 2. so that is equal alpha is equal to minus 4 in this case now second one Six. These two lines are parallel. Six by alpha is equal three by two. Six by alpha is equal to three by two. Six by alpha is equal to three by two. That implies. Alpha is equal to four here. These two are first condition. If two lines are parallel, then a one by a two is equal b one by b two is not equal to c one by c two. So if these two are parallel, so a one by a two is equal b one by b two. So from this condition, we get alpha equal to minus four. Now if two lines are parallel, a one by a two is equal b one by b two. So 6 by alpha is equal 3 by 2, so alpha is equal 4. So now, if lines are concurrent, if lines are concurrent, concurrent, then determinant is equal 0. Determinant 2, so 2 here 6. Alpha. Next minus one, three, two, minus three, four, four is equal to zero. Two six alpha minus one three two minus three four four equal to zero. So after simplification, we get alpha is equal to four by five here. Alpha is equal to four by five. Now here sigma alpha square means step sigma alpha square means step sigma alpha square means. Now first this is equal sixteen plus this is equal sixteen step of this. So now this is equal zero. Step of alpha sixteen by twenty five step zero. So ah uh, thirty six plus thirty six equal to 16 plus 16 equal to 32. So answer is 32. It's a so find the coefficient of find the coefficient of x power x power 2012. In one minus x whole power two thousand eight into one plus x plus x square two thousand seven. So we need to find the coefficient of x power two thousand twelve in One minus x whole power two thousand eight into one plus x plus x square to the power of two thousand seven. So now take one minus x whole power two thousand eight into one plus x plus x square whole power two thousand seven. Is equal here 
वन माइनस एक्स इंटू वन माइनस एक्स होल पवर टू थाउजेंड सेवन इंटू वन प्लस एक्स प्लस एक्स स्क्वेर होल पवर टू थाउजेंड सेवन सो दट इज इक्वल वन माइनस एक्स इंटू वन माइनस एक्स इंटू वन प्लस एक्स प्लस एक्स स्क्वेर होल पवर टू थाउजेंड सेवन दट इज इक्वल वन माइनस एक्स इंटू वन माइनस एक्स क्यूब होल पवर टू थाउजेंड सेवन सो दट इज इक्वल वन माइनस एक्स इंटू हियर सिग्मा आर इक्वल टू जीरो टू टू थाउजेंड सेवन इंटू टू थाउजेंड सेवन सी आर इंटू माइनस एक्स क्यूब होल पवर आर सो फ्रम आर जीरो टू टू थाउजेंड सेवन एक्सपैन मन को टू थौज एक्स पवर टू थौज ट्वेलव एक् रहा इक एक्सपैन काबी द टर्म कंटिंग एक्स पवर टू थौज ट्वेलव ईज जीरो सो काबी कोफिशेंट आफ कोफिशेंट आफ कोफिशेंट आफ हिर् coefficient of x power 2012 is equal to 0